Hey you guys, I'm here to show you a Pixelmator tutorial. Let me quit Cheetah. And let's open up Pixelmator. We're going to make these clouds. You can find this tutorial on the net, but a lot of my viewers don't scour the net like I do. So if I find a good tutorial, I'll share it with them. And um, uh, this is the case here. We're going to make these clouds. So let's start with a new one. A new sheet of paper. First thing I'm going to do is grab my gradient tool, which is right here. I'm going to pick the bluish color. You can see here, maybe get it a little darker. Let's say OK. And I'm going to go over here and I'm going to drag my gradient like this. Now we have this gradient, OK? We can go over here and name your layer if you want, but I'm not going to do that for this quick tutorial. Now, what I want to do is go to Filter, Generator, Clouds. And we're just going to hit OK because we already got our colors set up. Actually, I'm going to undo that and I'm going to get a new layer. I hit the plus key here and you'll get a new layer. Then add your clouds. So they'll be on two separate layers. Okay? So what I'm going to do now is add another layer and add that exact same set of clouds. But this time I'm going to set the blending mode to difference. Okay, so now I'm going to create one more layer and add those clouds one last time. Make the filter or the blending mode difference like last time. Now we have these three cloud layers in our gradient. Let's select our three cloud layers, right click, and merge layers. It'll bring them all to one. Now I can change the blend mode of all three of them to screen. And now we're starting to get our beginnings of a cloud. Um, we can go into our image and select levels. And this way we can kind of bring our clouds and adjust our clouds how we want it here. This one kind of maybe over blows out the clouds a little bit. And there we go. Look how good that looks, guys. I'm really impressed with the way Pixelmator. Um, results look. It's really, really um, good looking. I mean, I think this is, is is a really nice little program for $60. If you're into image editing and you just ain't got the money for Photoshop, start with Pixelmator. It really is a great little application. Thanks for watching, guys. If you want more of these tutorials, let me know and I'll make more Pixelmator tutorials, okay? If not, this is just... Um, quick example of what Pixelmator can do. I like to showcase Mac apps and I like to showcase what Mac apps can do and this is one pretty popular Mac app that I wanted to include. Thanks for watching guys.